If someone has money, if they have power, they can pretend to be as pious as hell and no one will ever suspect it. I always thought I wasn't worth a damn. Even when I made all pro quarterback, even at the top of my game, lead my team to the championship. My grandfather fought the Japanese here in World War II and never left, married a local girl. My father was native born and a sergeant major. My father was a chief inspector for the Hong Kong police. He died when I was 10. And I told myself then that I would follow in his footsteps. I joined the force after graduating at the top of my class. But the men in charge never intended for me to be a real police officer. They didn't believe... My name's Perna, and I'm gonna tell you about the worst bloody holiday ever. I was at the Royal Palms Resort on Benoy, working as a bodyguard for some asshole CEO. I figured once he left the island, I'd have a good week to relax on the beach, enjoy a Mai Tai or two. But no, that wasn't to be. As I woke up one morning to discover that the goddamn zombie apocalypse had arrived. A local lifeguard by the name of Cinnamon saved my life. Soon after that, I discovered I was immune to whatever this plague was. I met a few others who were immune, and somehow we were all elected to save everybody else. There was Sam B, a one-hit wonder hip-hop star from the States. Logan, an ex-football player and full-time douchebag who never missed a chance to hit on him. And Shin Mei, a sweet little hotel clerk who was as brutal with a blade as anyone I had ever seen. Together, we went to Norsby to try to gather more supplies. And from there, things really went to hell. The army tried to contain the infection, but they were bloody useless. Benoit itself was totally isolated. It was pretty clear we were on our own. At this point, we just wanted off that goddamn island. And that's what led us to that maximum security prison. You see, some dickhead colonel by the name of Ryder White lied to get us to track down what he thought was a cure for this zombie plague. Well, that cure ended up turning White into a giant bloody maniac. Luckily, we hooked up with a prisoner who flew us out of there on the colonel's helicopter. We were off that goddamn island at last. And everyone we tried to save back on Benoit, well, they just didn't make it. Except for that little native girl, Yerima. We spotted that naval vessel just in time, as we were just about out of petrol. We couldn't believe how lucky we were to finally find a safe haven. your hands off me. What the hell? What is going on here? Oh, get off me! Ah! Get it off me! Get it off! What's with the cops? Sorry, but I can't take any chances. My orders are to take you into custody and transport you to a secure quarantine area. And who the hell are you? Lieutenant Colonel Samuel Hardy. Don't resist and you'll be fine. We just need to be sure you don't pose Man, a threat. we no threat. The threat's on Benoit. You have any idea what's happening back there? We have an idea. We're hoping you can help us fill in the details. Especially her. You keep the hell away from her. Frank Serpo. I should have guessed. Are you the one in charge of this clusterfuck? Watch yourself with this guy. This freak would sell out his own mother. If he had one. Take the immune down to the lab. The two others will come with me. 
Lab. Hey, do we look like goddamn guinea pigs I'm to a you? citizen of the USA, man. I got motherfucking rights. Back off, Serpo. But just stay out of it. <laughs> Don't do that again. One less immune won't make any difference. Now take him to the lab. You may have command over Palanai, but on this ship, I'm in charge and I have my orders. Your orders are to follow my orders, Colonel. Would you like me to call your superiors? Somebody tell me what the fuck is going on here. They have a very high tolerance, Mr. Serpo. I've already administered three doses. So how much longer? You said we'd have results by now. Sir, this is uncharted territory. We'll need another day at least. Just be careful. We don't want them dying on us. What about the native woman, Yerima? That's a more complicated case. She's being taken to another location. Don't worry. I'm keeping a close eye. Oh, God. Oh, my head. Oh. Oh, what the hell happened? Oh. Motherfuckers drugged us. Who are you? Hey, we're talking to you. I'm nobody, really. You've been bitten. How long has it been? Long enough. I guess it doesn't affect me. So you immune too? So it seems. What? They plant you here to spy on us. <laughs> right. That's one beat to shit like this. It's all part of my cover. So they tested you too? Yeah. I'm guessing they're trying to figure out why we're all immune to this. How'd you get here? I was a soldier before the shit hit the fan. Part of a huge humanitarian search and rescue operation. And then that civilian arrived. So Right. Suddenly, the military was no longer in charge, and the rescue operation was called off. So what are they up to? All I know is there's a naval blockade around the entire archipelago. No one's allowed in or out. Whatever the fuck is going on, there's nothing to do with humanitarian efforts. That's pretty clear. Christ, I'm still woozy from these bloody drugs. Oh, God, my head. Where are the others? They must have taken them when I was unconscious. Better find a way out of here. Where is it?
need to find a weapon. There's no one here, Captain. Not anymore. Like the walkway's clear. Whoever took care of that, you deserve accommodation. You just saved a lot of lives. Sick of this. Get this demon off me! Get out of here. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's it. I'm going vegan. Get out of here. Let's open this up.
Just leave them here. They're civilians. If I were you, I'd worry about your own survival, Colonel. Servo! You! Get up here! Captain! Come here! Your captain is dead, soldier! Oh no! Is that a rock? Collision course, we have to get to the bridge. Yeah, we've got another problem. We've got company. Shoot that bloody thing! Open your eyes. Here they come. Monster. Let's 
Hey, hey, wake up. You all right? Oh, what happened? The ship... Get up. The ship's dead in the water. Can you walk? I guess so. Where am I? Hal and I. But it's really not safe here on the beach. There's an infection. Some sort of plague. Oh, God. Not again. The whole island's gone to hell. So... It's spreading. We'll talk later. Right now you need to move. Head for the Paradise Survival Camp. Look for the big treehouse. You'll find other survivors there. Take this. In the meantime, I'll see if anyone else washed up on the beach. This storm was a disaster.
Oh, thanks heaps. Those monsters nearly caught me. Yeah, I heard from Harlow that you were coming. Close. Oh, Jesus. I'm glad you made it. I thought we were goners. Where the hell did you come from? We were on a ship, but, but that isn't important. That bridge is putting us all at risk. We need to do something about it. You're not telling me anything I don't know. The bridge is our bloody weak spot. We've got some fences. Maybe securing the other entrances will slow them down. But I need you to put them up. Can you lend a hand? Absolutely. Uh, I appreciate it. Grab the rolled fences and put them up in the designated spots. Am I glad to see you? I'm glad Thank you God made it. God. Am I glad to see you? All right, let's put the barricades right there.
Bloody hell, that was close. It's truth. I was hoping it wouldn't come to that, but they would have overrun us. Now, the fences are working, but you were right about the bridge. We need to blow it. It's too dangerous. Take this flare gun and use it to ignite the barrels by the bridge. your help. I heard the explosion. You blew the damn bridge? Was that really necessary? Oh, thank God you survived. Yeah, now I owe you something, motherfucker. Get up, you son of a bitch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I owe whoa. you something, too. Apparently, you've all met. I know what it looks like, but I swear to God, I meant you no harm. That operation was out of my hands. It was Serpo. So who was he? He works for a private concern. His superiors own my superiors, and they're the ones calling the shots. I'm sorry for what they did to you, but there's no way that he... What exactly are they doing here, Colonel? The rumor is they're trying to weaponize this plague for use as a bioweapon. Being immune, my guess is your blood is essential for their research. You knew this, yet you did nothing to stop them. I'm a soldier. I follow orders. Well, soldier, here's an order for you. Go fuck yourself. Just listen to me. I can help you. There's a military outpost in Henderson, and I know the commanding officer. They have food, water, weapons, and a way off this bloody island. <laughs> Last time we trusted the army, they threw us in a cage. Look, I understand how you feel, but we don't have much time here. This island, it's about to be nuked. Newt? Yeah, we heard that same story on Benor. Ain't no bombs fell there. Are you sure about that? This would explain all the air traffic recently. Choppers flying out with equipment crates. That's right. They have to cover up what they've done here. And once they're through evacuating the island... They're dropping a bomb? Listen, I trust this asshole about as far as I can throw him. But if what he's saying is true... We, we need to get out. off this goddamn island. Fuck me, man. So, Henderson it is then. If that's the case, then we're all coming with you. All right then. Let's move. Only five of us are immune, so some of us should stay and defend the camp while the rest scout for a way out of here. Good. Let's get to it. All right, Colonel. But if you're lying to us, God help you, because we sure won't. Hi, come here. What can I do to help? If I can electrify the fences, those damn things will fry when they run into them. But I need a power source. Cables and batteries should do it. Will you bring me some? May. Fine. But don't come bitching to me when those things get in here. I need your help. I used to run a lighthouse, you know, before this uh, bloody mess started. You and Hardy don't like each other very much, do you? Yeah, well, he locked me in the hold of that ship. I barely escaped. That's not gonna cause any problems for the rest of us, is it? We've got enough to worry about. I don't think that's your concern. Now tell me how to get to Henderson. The jungle's flooded from the monsoons, so I think the only way is by the sea. One of the other guys here is from Halai. And he says it's a fishing village. They should still have boats. Once you get one of them, it shouldn't be hard to reach Henderson. When are you leaving? I'll do my best. Good. The sooner you get to Henderson, the sooner we get out of here. As you can see, we each contribute to the team's safety and well-being with our own particular talents. If you bring us the right supplies, you can take advantage of our talents too. Thank God you came when you did. A lot of people have been dying around here.
Die! 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 things. Maybe there's something in here.
So I found a lagoon, Harlow, and there's a marina here, but there's a lot of infected. I'll have to deal with them before I can look for a boat. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 